Hi, I'm Alan Reid. I'm uh, the Associate Dean for Education in the Faculty of Education and I work with Sylvia and various other teachers and trainee teachers looking at how to develop sustainable futures in schools. It's a really important project to be involved in at the moment. We know there's a lot of debate about what the curriculum should be nationally and particularly this kind of work obviously engages students, engages families and parents and engages the schools as well in lots of new, exciting and innovative ways of teaching and learning. I think one of the strengths of the project, which you can see here today, is that it's a long-term commitment to working with local schools. Um, Sylvia and her team have been working here on and off for about the last five to ten years in, with schools in Frankston and then the local area, so Dorinia, Frankston, um, Xavier as well. And there's a strong commitment from the community to supporting this kind of work. And so it's great for our trainee teachers to know what's going on, um, but also to get a real feel for uh, what goes on on the ground in schools and which will affect the community. This is the uh, movable forest uh, where you can uh, move it to from one place to another. Well, this is our dream catcher and we recycle called a bike wheel. We put our dreams in the dream catcher and we just planted some seeds inside it. We decorated it with wool and we recycled stuff. Well, we put flowers in the tins and we made it beautiful around it. Our dream catcher is about recycling and bringing the kids' uh, dreams alive with them and making them connect to their learning. It's helped us um, learn how to connect the outside with the inside with the learning so kids come outside and they actually choose what they want to do. And We love the experience as we're pre-service teachers. Um, it benefits us so much to have the one-on-one -on -one with the kids to learn what they want to learn. Welcome to Monash Sustainability Groups. This is a butterfly garden. We've got colourful rocks for the butterflies to come. We've got lavender that smells good. We've got types of different colours. Each tile was designed by the kids as their vision of what a sustainable future could look like. And then we put them into the garden as a way of bringing children out into nature and getting to experience it more. We started by basically discussing what they already knew. So things like recycling, worm farms, just like bringing nature back into the general world that a student lives in. And then from there we built up the future and ways we can continue to maintain the world. And I think that's part of what these projects really helped do, was help connect the students with their own local area.